investigation is widening into the Orange County School District over allegations of anti-Semitic attacks. The details are shocking. Reports of violence and even swastikas drawn on the students' face. And it's all rocking the Pine Bush Central School District. It has gotten so bad, Governor Andrew Cuomo's office is now involved. News 12's Carolyn Rowe has the details. I'm shocked and appalled. Pine Bush High School teacher Annette Wright says she felt sick after reading this article in the New York Times detailing a lawsuit against her district. Three families claim their children have been harassed by other students because they are Jewish, saying there have been swastikas around their schools, jokes about the Holocaust and physical attacks. One Jewish student was reportedly beaten with a hockey stick, while another had a swastika forcibly drawn on her face. Wright says this does not sound like the Pine Bush Central School District she knows. I think the lawsuit is completely unfounded and unfair, but as I'm saying this, um, I would question my students and say, why is it that you think, uh, you know, have you seen anything like this in your school? I have never seen it in 25 years. It's a story that has shaken this small Orange County town. It's just, it's a shock, complete shock to probably everybody in the community. It's hard to believe. I could not believe. I still can't believe it. It's an issue that officials on several levels of government are now looking into. The Attorney General's office says they launched an investigation last November after receiving complaints that Jewish students in the Pine Bush School District were being harassed. And Governor Cuomo has now directed the state police and Division of Human Rights to investigate the claim, saying New York State has zero tolerance for bigotry or hate. The Orange County Human Rights Commission is also investigating. Meanwhile, School Superintendent Joan Carbone couldn't speak about about the pending litigation, but she did say they hope the school district's actions will be vindicated, saying the district takes all reports of bullying and discrimination seriously and provides programs and trainings about tolerance for all. In Pine Bush, Carolyn Rowe, News 12.